Hi viewers, you are watching DS Lifestyle and in today's video we will talk about how to feed your arowana fish. So let's get started. Arowanas are very majestic creatures, they are very beautiful. But as per as me, in the freshwater hobbies, this fish is the most difficult fish to feed. Actually, arowana is a very moody creature. Whatever he wants, he will eat. It is not like a fish that would eat whatever you would throw in your tank. It would only eat the things which he would like. And sometimes it goes on hunger strike without any reason. You cannot predict that hunger strike and you cannot do anything about it. You can just give him variety of food. If he likes some, some sort of food, some sort of specific food, then he would start eating. So I will be telling you about three types of food which you should give to your arowana. We have divided the food into three parts. First is pellets or dry food. Second is live food. And third is fresh food. First we will talk about pellets or dry food. So pellets are the best food for arowana as per as me because they contain all the essential nutrients required for arowana. The companies which do make the pellet for arowana keep in mind that the pellet should have such an effect on arowana that the arowana should grow to its full size and show its color in its full potential. If your arowana is accepting pellets then you should give floating type of pellet to your fish. Do not give sinking pellets to your fish because if you would give sinking pellets to your fish then your fish would look at the bottom of tank a lot which would cause drop eye to your fish. Some of the best pellets available in market as per as me are ARG2 or Arowana G2 by Ocean Free then Hikari Floating Sticks by Hikari and 9-in-1 Azu Arowana Sticks these, kind, uh, these three foods are very good as per as me. Now let's talk about live food as the name suggests Live food is a food which is still living. You are feeding a living creature to your fish. Mealworms and superworms are some of the best live food as per as me because they contain a lot amount of protein and most of the arowana enjoy eating them. You should give mealworms and superworms twice or thrice in a week to your fish. Don't feed a lot of, a lot of these worms to your fish because they may cause digestive issue in your fish. As digestive tract of arowana is quite small so if you would feed a lot of worms to your arowana then your arowana may suffer from some digestive tract issues. Another type of live feed is giving feeder fish to your arowana. I am against it because it is a quite long and fuzzy process. First you need to quarantine the feeder fish which you buy from the market. Then after quarantining it you need to assure that the fish doesn't contain any parasite and after assuring this you can feed this to your arowana. So as per as me this is a quite long process and you cannot instantly give that thing to your fish. If you give the feeder fish to your arowana in a hurry and the feeder fish contains any parasite in itself then your arowana would suffer from disease or some sort of parasite, a parasite disorder. The parasite would uh, cause damage to your arowana. So I am against feeding these kind of feeder fish to your arowana. And these feeder fish do not contain a lot amount of nutrition. They also contain a lot amount of fat which can also cause drop eye to your fish. If your fish is not eating anything then you can try giving feeder fish or any type of live food to your arowana. It may help your arowana to eat. Let's talk about fresh food. By fresh food, I mean market prawns. You can feed market prawns to your fish just by cleaning it, removing the head, removing the shell and removing the vein present inside the market prawn. Market prawns helps the fish in becoming bulk bulkier and it helps the fish in improving its red coloration. So it is good for your fish but it contains a lot amount of fat. If you are giving a lot of prawns to your fish then it may cause drop eye issue but you can also fix it by adding a wave maker in your tank the wave maker would make waves and when your fish will swim in opposite of these waves then the fish would burn some calories and the fat would be absorbed and broken down so you can just add a wave maker and feed these market prawns to your fish they are good for your fish
these were all the types of food you can give to your arowana and i hope the video was informative and the video proved to be useful for you all i hope you all enjoyed the video and stay tuned subscribe my channel like this video and turn on the notification bell icon for more updates thank you